Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So finally, the latest version of the Microsoft Edge web browser for desktop version 102 has started rolling out. Now, this latest release should have actually rolled out last week according to the release schedule, but nonetheless, Microsoft has made that available now and it started rolling out on the 31st of May, which was yesterday in my region of the world. Now, believe it or not, a, for a version upgrade, version 102 does not contain any new features. According to the release notes for the stable channel, uh, Microsoft makes no mention of any new features. Um, it obviously gets those all important security updates, which we will talk about shortly. And then all they mention here is that they have made uh, four new policies available uh, in version 102. So this is mainly a security update uh, in this latest stable release. Now, uh, in total, there are 24 security fixes in version 102. And most of those are security fixes, um, the latest security updates of the Chromium project, which the web browser is based on. And so that will contain all those security fixes from uh, the Chromium uh, platform. And then there are also um, three Microsoft Edge specific updates uh, that are related to the actual browser. Um, and just to mention those quickly, um, out of the three, uh, two of those vulnerabilities are elevation of privilege and there's one spoofing based vulnerability that's also been addressed. So we have 24 security vulnerabilities that have been addressed. Out of those 24 vulnerabilities, uh, 21 are Chromium based uh, security vulnerabilities and three of those are edge specific vulnerabilities that have been fixed. So in total, 24 security fixes um, which have rolled out in version 102. Now to see if you have this latest release, as always, we just head to the menu in the top right, help and feedback about Microsoft Edge. And um, the uh, browser updates will take place automatically in the background, as I do always say, if you do use the browser on a regular basis. But if it hasn't, and this will force the update. And as I always mentioned with uh, security fixes, uh, it's always good to double check and the latest version is 102, that's 102.0.1245.30. So that's the latest stable version, which surprisingly, as mentioned, doesn't contain any new features, but does contain 24 security fixes in total. Now, one thing I have noticed, though, and I don't know if this is actually a little new change in option that is rolled out with this latest release version 102, or if it was just a coincidence, um, but we have a little new option uh, in the appearance uh, section of the uh, menu and settings menu for web select. Now web select, just to uh, backtrack a little bit, web select um, was already available in the context menu in Edge. So if we just head to uh, the right click context menu, there was an option uh, in the stable version called web select. But now if we just head back to those uh, the settings menu, and we head to appearance. Yeah, you'll find a new toggle for a shortcut button that'll that will appear here in the toolbar called web select button. And as I say, I don't know if this is just coincidence, if this was a server side update or if this actually did roll out with version 102. Um, as mentioned in the release notes, there is no mention of any features. So this there's a very good chance that this is just coincidence and this is a server side update. And if we toggle that on. And we head back to there. You'll see, to the uh, um, the uh, new tab page. You'll see here in the uh, the uh, toolbar in the top right. The we now have web select, which is right next to web capture. And basically, web select is just a slimmed down version of web capture, and it just lets you select and capture a part of a web page in the Edge browser, and then you can just copy that to clipboard or to a document to work to work on at a late, later stage. So I just thought I'd let you know about that. That little web select button now, shortcut button is also now available. So that's it for version 102 as, 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 I, as I've mentioned. No new features, 24 security updates, and then um, this little web select button now which lets you capture part of your screen, which most probably was a server side update and wasn't related to the actual um, rollout of version 102. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.